Hey guys, Trez here coming to you guys yet again with another reaction video and today uh, we're going to be checking out a awesome band uh, hailing all the way from Sweden. Uh, this is Revenge Prevails. Cool fucking name by the way. Just <laughs> um, actually, I wasn't planning on doing a, uh, a reaction video. Um, I was planning on doing an unboxing video. Um, because uh, I got gifted uh, this package from, from the band and uh, thank you Joseph uh, uh, Joseph uh, is the lead singer and guitarist for Revenge Prevails uh, He sent me a, a nice uh, little uh, package here a little gift package um, That you guys maybe you guys have seen in other uh, channels as well Really awesome, really generous dude, and uh, I thank thank you for that. Uh, for I was gonna do the <laughs> unboxing uh, and see because I still still sealed. I still haven't opened it up. So I cheers, thank you, thank you again. Um, but I just noticed um, when I was gonna do it today that they had released a, uh, a lyrical video for reinventing the wheel um, from the album Habitat. Uh, Habitats. Yeah, I had no idea that <laughs> until today that I was about to set up to do the unboxing video. I noticed that they had uh, uh, released on the 31st, um, I think it was yesterday. Um, depends on when this video is going to be released anyway. But um, yeah, I was like, oh, fuck it. Let's do a fucking whole thing. Usually I like to uh, listen to a song twice just to get the feel of it, of the song. But I've, I've heard the song before. Um, I haven't seen the video, but, um, again, I got a package here, so, hey, fuck it. Um, instead of doing the video twice, I'm just gonna listen, uh, watch the video, and then do the little unboxing here, so we could, uh, uh, check this whole thing out. So, yeah, anyway, guys, cheers, um, to you, uh, Joseph, and to Revenge Prevails. Cool name. And, uh, yeah, let's fucking do this.
Oh, this fucking... Again, awesome song. Um, the, the lyrics kind of threw me off a little bit. Um, because, uh, obviously, I've been listening through it through Bandcamp. All links will be dropped down below again, so you can check it out yourself. But um, there's an option on Bandcamp, so you could... Uh, uh, obviously see the lyrics but I, I never my dumbass never decided to do that um, it's a good thing for lyrical videos too because I never would have guessed um, uh, the lyrics for this uh, but I, I, I think I've heard this before uh, at least the chorus uh, obviously the imagery the uh, Kala Chakra uh, Sar, Sar, no. Some, some, what is it? Some, some, some Sarah, some Shura, some Shara. I, I don't know. But I've heard this before. Um, it's kind of like, um, obviously, looking at the the video. Um, I think it's uh, based on the reincarnation and re uh, death or reincarnate. Obviously, death and reincarnation and the repeating cycle. Obviously, reinventing the wheel. Um, but, uh, obviously you see a lot of destruction and fuck, fucking madness, pretty much. Um, so, again, it's a very bleak, uh, video, bleak outcome, and, um, could be the same thing repeating over and over again. Uh, we're doomed to repeat ourselves. You know, this day we tremble when revenge prevails. <laughs> so, yeah. Cheers. Well, well done. So anyway, uh, getting down to, um, normally again, I will watch the video again just to check it out and uh, um, catch things that I didn't uh, listen to before. But again, I've been wa listening to this band for a couple of weeks now. And um, again, got this package sent from uh, Joseph, um, coming all the way from Sweden, from obviously uh, the... Um, uh, main vocalist and guitarist for um, this band. Um, I haven't opened it, so I was planning on doing that again uh, today until I realized that uh, they released a lyrical video, so I thought I'd just uh, do a whole combo thing. So I haven't opened it besides this little cut that was already there, and so we're gonna check it out now. Actually, I don't even think I need the, the knife, to be honest. But maybe I do. <laughs> okay. Oh, sweet. Okay. Everything is right here. So, sweet. Oh, nice. Okay. Oh, hold on. It's kind of, there's a little seal there, a little pentagram there, really awesome, I don't even know if I should open that, that's kind of cool, I don't know if I should cut the side of it, ah, fuck, I don't know, these kind of things are cool, I don't know what I, fuck I should do, fuck it, I'm gonna fucking cheat. Oh, there we go. That didn't fuck up the seal. Awesome. <laughs> That's fucking cool. That's some cool shit. Awesome, awesome. Thank you. Uh, greetings, hope you like... Nice little message here. Greetings, hope you like the albums uh, sent along. Our previous album from uh, 2017 called False Hope. Really brutal album. I've checked it out before. Cruelty, and of course, uh, our new album from uh, 2020 Habitats. Hope you really like them sincerely. Uh, Revenge for Veils, <laughs> Joseph. Really? Oh shit! These. Oh wow, these are actually fucking pictures. That's fucking... 
<laughs> That's fucking awesome. Signed. Holy shit. That's awesome. Wow, these are nice. These are really fucking nice. I'll see if I could take a better image here, but anyway, this is just awesome. Uh, thank you again, uh, Revenge Prevails, uh, Joseph, Isabella, Ludwig, uh, and Christopher. Um, this is really fucking cool. Really awesome. Again, got uh, False Hope Cruelty um, Punishing album. Actually, really fucking good. Really heavy as fuck. Um, really awesome. Again, I'll be uh, dropping a link down below, but um, songs on here are fucking vicious. Really fucking awesome. Again, everything will be dropped down below so you can check it out yourself, but <laughs> this is so fucking awesome. This album is really, really fucking heavy as fuck and vicious again sounding. Thank you. Thank you so much. And again, to the album. This is uh, recorded, by the way, from I think it was November, uh, obviously last year, um, 2019, and through February 2020. Habitats. That's so fucking cool. Again, um, the artwork was done by Isabella, uh, the basis for, for uh, Revenge Prevails, uh, and, and obviously um, Angelic Voice. <laughs> um, really awesome. Oh, this hidden within the hive that song you know her voice on that is just so so powerful again her voice on every track on this um on her is just fucking awesome nightmares over promised land the name the name itself again the names of these songs are really fucking cool limbless i kept reaching really fucking cool and I love that um, this band, um, it's really cool when a band, um, when they make a song, they don't try to get through a song, uh, they take their time and let the, the instruments speak for the band. It's really cool when you get a band that uh, just uh, has a moment of silence, I guess, uh, with no vocals and starts doing their own thing. and really fucking awesome and letting the instruments speak for themselves um but really amazing i love the dynamic uh nature between the between joseph and isabella um uh, on their vocals um obviously uh joseph has that uh really fucking grit and sharpness to his voice and he could do a very uh very um a dry, long <laughs> sounding um, growl. It's fucking awesome. Pure fucking death metal. Uh, really cool, like uh, far end of the sprawl. And uh, the devastation that we brought. Uh, what I like about that song is that, um, again, like I mentioned before, um, when a band takes their time, not just to try to rush through the song, but again, takes their time just to uh, do a little, maybe an interlude, I don't know what you call it, but um, the the rehearsals for this band has got to be fucking amazing. The, the creative process is what I enjoy the most of being in multiple bands, my, multiple bands myself. But uh, what I truly love is when you could tell that this band uh, spends time communicating with each other and uh, getting energy off of each other and the, the inspiration from each other um, when they do little pieces like uh, like the last song on this uh, the second to last song the devastation that we brought and also multiple songs from from this album that they take a little space and just uh, jam out pretty much and it sounds fucking amazing and again the devastation that we brought that last part of that song where they keep on repeating the devastation that we 
with and the, and the guitar work behind that again uh, guitar work is very sharp their uh, solos are fucking beautiful done by uh, again done by uh, um, uh, Christopher um, drums really awesome touches obviously Lou Wing on guitars and uh, Joseph on guitars and obviously Isabella on bass really well done but uh, what Blue Wing and obviously Joseph play on each other on, on the guitar part is just fucking sick sounding. And obviously the big bass, uh, bass line that Isabella does and accent pieces and does her own thing too sounds amazing. Her voice is just obviously very powerful too and it, it's, it doesn't get drowned out that's the other thing about this album too that um, nothing gets drowned out you could hear everything that the the drum is doing what uh, Christopher is doing and uh, you could get to hear that he allows um, aspects of the song to shine um, by themselves without overpowering everything nothing has to be a blast beat nothing has to be you know in your face he allows these little touches to be done, which is really fucking cool. That, that accentuates the rest of the album. The vocals as well, their own instruments, Isabella and Joseph, uh, what they do to this. Um, there's one song on here, if I could remember correctly. Um, I think it's uh, the same song, The Devastation That We Brought. Um, into that small interlude or whatever you want to call it uh, and you got the drums and then you got the drums starting to uh, build up a little bit and, and he, it's kind of like a peppering of uh, a sprinkle of, of vocals that he does that starts like building up a little bit really well made a really well touch on there and again uh, when you're in a band, there's a, obviously a give or take, and there's a, there's an understanding when you make a song and what you want to achieve, and to have this vision of this this album and all the the, the riffs because they're riffs upon riffs on every single song, the solos are beautiful. Uh, these guys know their instruments and know when to implement them. That's the cool thing about this, is that you're not getting an album and it's like a boring listen. This is a, a, a fun listen. I mean, you're going to have fun listening to this. Um, if I had to say this, I know we just talked about bleakness and all this other stuff. Uh, that comes with the vocals and the lyrical themes and, and stuff. But um, as an all-out all metalhead, I guess... <laughs> um, this is just a fun listen because uh, there's besides riffs upon riffs everybody knows what they're doing and what their role is and but it's a natural thing when you listen to this because everybody the drummer allows knows when to not do I would go ape shit and start blast beating um, the basses and there's little elements that you will hear um, electronical elements as well that you will hear on this album that are like very well thought out and well placed like the, okay that if that wasn't there I don't know what what would happen because everything that they put in this song and every song those little touches is like okay that yeah I could imagine them um, the process of recording this must have taken either they were all on the same page or there was like a little bit when you're in a band you gotta uh, learn to compromise and learn to how to uh, try things out I don't know how many versions of the, <laughs> the song were made uh, but that's at least my experience uh, when um, being in a band God knows how many versions of the song we went through just to come up with something that we would, we could all understand. We're like, okay, I see what you're saying. Uh, uh, one vision, and to to come out so fucking good, it, it's like very unique. And um, this band fucking nails it. 
uh, within Isabella's uh, vocals and um, Joseph's harsh vocals and his other vocals range that he has that's uh, screeching and that um, very curling guttural uh, voice that he has and as well as obviously he's a guitarist so he should know where to p implement that voice it is really spot on and yeah really enjoyable in that aspect um, so yeah really really awesome uh, awesome sound obviously the recording really good really sharp um, punishing at times on the, the the solos and the little again the little acoustic parts and the little interludes that each song has and they give the space for the instruments to speak are very fucking awesome so anyway guys um thank you guys and for checking this uh, lyrical video out and me talking about uh, the band revenge Perez again and also joseph thank you so much yeah, like, obviously for sending this package these are fucking awesome these are so fucking cool i can't wait to like frame these up and yeah really awesome and again that that wax seal here pentagram so fucking nice touch and false hope cruelty awesome album vicious sounding too <sighs> fucking riffs for days as well as this one uh, habitats just so fucking good everything will be linked down below so you can check it out yourself from bank app and facebook and everything i can find from these guys um so really really awesome and again thank you so fucking much and like i always end these things um take care of yourself take care of each other stay hydrated and maybe a machete swing away from each other <laughs> and support my wife's life insurance. Cheers.